So what the uh, style of music that y'all are making, like, are y'all going to try to keep it pop punk with some of the stuff um, we were listening to earlier? Actually, on the way here, we was talking about changing it to like a emo type hyper pop. Like something that's not really been done before. Uh, what is some that? kind of What's new hyper-pop? genre. It's like an emo hyper pop. What's what would you like relate that to? Like, I mean, like what's <laughs> like what's an example of that? Like hyper pop, uh, like Oliver Tree or something like that. Okay. Maybe. Okay. okay. I like that. Or Dude. like 100 Gex or something like that. Uh, All right. All right. Lil Uzi, Sofago. Kondra, yeah. Sofago's a big one. Who? Sofago. 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 I've never heard of Sofago. I've never heard of him. Really? Mm-hmm. What's. I know Oliver Tree, though. Cash Machine. Oh, oh yeah, dude. Stuff so good... like that. Oh, my God. It's such a good song. I, I love, like, how music just doesn't have a genre no, nowadays. It's, yeah, yeah it's nice. that's true. You're mixing everything together now. I do everything, man. And, and, and yeah. it's cool to have, like, this kind of, like, pop punk, like, renaissance yeah. coming up. I guess MGK started that. That's. I don't know. Fallout Boy. Like one yeah. eight two. Well, well, that that's Panic like the bands like that like really started. I'm talking okay. like the like the renaissance of it, like the last few years. Okay, okay oh, yeah. yeah, MGK yeah, then. MGK probably. I would yeah. I would put MGK. Uh, Scar right, Scar Lord. Scar, I would say Scar Lil Lord. Peep, dude. That's oh good, yeah, dude. Lil Peep was a big Lil one. Lil Peep started the whole. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. what. The you're popular right. roster. Peep Tracy all of GBC. Yeah. yeah. No, yeah. and that um uh, that uh X X X ten. Yeah. How did you say that? It's Tentacion. 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 Something, dude. I don't even know. Uh, it actually means uh, unknown, uh, unknown, temptation. unknown temptation. Yeah, that's what it means. Yeah, XXX Tentacion. <sighs> XXX Tentacles. <laughs> that's, I was going to say something else, but <laughs> I, I was too. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't. But I mean, it, it's it, it's it's cool to have like this uh, new style of pop punk coming back, man. Because I mean, like. That was that was just good music growing my, up. Dude. It's refreshing, bro. It's like a breath of fresh air. Yeah, it's like, yeah, it's it. nostalgic, really Absolutely. nostalgic. But it, it was also music that, like you were talking about earlier, that like kids and just people in general can relate to because a yeah. lot of just punk music in general, whether it's pop or the grunge stuff or whatever, it was talking about real world problems yeah. and the stuff yeah. that people were having to deal with. It wasn't just oh, I've got a f- Nice car. I've got a lot of money. Yeah. Can you imagine yeah. doing drugs? Yeah. 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 Pop punk being works. like that. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it'd be kind of funny if they I did. Got a nice it'd be car. hilarious. But I, it's 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 just so cool to like. It's like Joe Kenji. That's what he does. He's like the pop punk kind of like brag about everything he has, but it's pop punk. Hmm. I, I've never got people like that. That's the type of people I don't want to hang out with in life. <laughs> like who cares, That's man? Yeah. I, I think music is just like it's supposed. Music is if it don't have a purpose, then what are you making music for? Exactly. You know that's true. I mean, like, music is art. It is. You know, and like that's like the people that we grew up listening to. Like they had an impact on our life one way or oh, another. Absolutely. You know, and that's that's the beauty of music. And it's also, I think that artists that do that stay more relative than those who don't. Oh yeah, dude. People like that fall off so quickly, dude. Yeah. It's, it's the ones that jump on the bandwagon of trends. No, yeah, dude, I and, hate that. Yeah, mm-hmm. see, see, like, y'all, I mean, you really have your own sound, especially, like, what you do with your Space Boy stuff. Yeah. That's, yeah. I mean, the it's song you, that you played me earlier, I've never heard anything like that. Mm-hmm. That's That was more of, like, a, yeah, a pop song. I wouldn't call it hyper pop. It was more, it was slow. So it was more of just, like, a poppy vibe to it. Like, uh, let me think of an artist like that. Uh, Kid Cudi. I mean, like. I don't know. Well, Similar. even him. Well, I mean, even really. then, it was like rap with Kid Cudi either. Like, he's yeah. always been like that little melodic rapper. That one was more singing, so I would I would relate it more of like just pop in general. Just yeah, right. I don't I don't consider myself a rapper. Like I used to rap a lot, dude. Yeah, it's still amazing at it. By the I way, I mean I can rap. I just I don't know. I don't want to. It gets what? repetitive, don't it? I just don't want to be in that circle. What you made know? you want to like stop rapping though? Like what's like what is it with the circle that you didn't like? <laughs> I don't know, dude. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's just I don't know man like I just I just never was I was always the emo kid you know I get that like the rock star type of kid with the long hair and like everybody yeah. that raps is like I don't want to hear that yeah, you know, why's so your nose painted black you know Yeah. and it was like I don't know it it just rock and like pop punk emo it even fits you like more. pop when I first met Skeezy more. I thought he was like 42 oh yeah <laughs> <dude>. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. He doesn't look 18. <laughs> I'm not 18. Are you You're 19? 18. I'm not 10, dude. You're for Why? real? I'm only 19? 19? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. He looks 42. 
I oh, thought man, it was. I, thought I really did. It's it's probably the beard. Oh, dude, yeah, I straightened my beard off look like a 12-year-old girl. <laughs> How long have you been growing that beard for? <laughs> I started growing a beard when I was like 15. You just haven't shaved it since? I mean, I've shaved it like twice since, but like I just, I keep it. Usually. That's impressive. Yeah. It's very impressive. That's very <laughs> impressive. <laughs> it's a beautiful beard. Appreciate it, bro. <laughs>